everyone welcome to jira beginners training and in this video i'm going to discuss how you are going to update any issue type within jira with different details so once say for example the issue has been created and you want to update the details of the issue doesn't matter what type of issue issue it is you can go ahead and quickly open the details for example say for example this epic or or this particular task right so i want to add more details to it or update the details you simply have to go to the issue detail basically browse that particular issue or open the detail issue detail page for example if i go to the backlog here and straight away i click on this particular task here you will see in the right hand side the detail section opens for that particular issue so i can perform some actions from here as well but if you want to have a full screen view here you can go ahead and open the detail view in new tab there and i can go ahead and click on add to add a particular attachment if say for example this particular issue has certain attachments or i can add a subtask to, to this particular issue which i have already explained i can link the issue issues right so i can link different issues to this particular issue by the linking options that are available there so for example this particular issue if it is blocked by some bug i can go ahead and say is blocked by and then search for the issue which blocks this particular issue and then click on link so that particular link will get created which will show that this particular issue ria2 is being blocked by ria4 okay similarly i can update the description if i go to add again i can also add a web link right so external link so i can go ahead and add the external link and the text which is relevant for this particular issue if you want to reference any of the external link for example you are into the content writing space you want to refer the web links that the content has been referred to or or you can go ahead and refer you can provide those external web links here and link to this particular issue i'll cover the loom video section and existing loom video section in a complete different video when i'll cover the loom functionality but you can also go ahead and add the loom video or existing loom video to this particular issue now updating the, the description simply click on the description section and update the description or add the description if it doesn't exist so that's absolutely simple as well there is nothing too tricky in order to if you are using jira just for uh, just as a user there is not much difficulty i would say in using jira right so anything updating or adding is not a problem right similarly if you want to see what all details so you'll see that if you go to the below section you will see all activity which shows all of the activity for this particular issue that has happened right so you'll see what when it was created what was updated work log history comments etc if you just want to see comments you can go ahead and click on comments history work log all of that is available in the activity section to add a comment you can simply go ahead and click on add comment and save the comment and comment will be available for this particular issue now here in the right hand side you can update the details for example you want to update the assignee you can click on the unassigned or if there was a different assignee there i can click on there and i can start typing uh the name of the team member whom i want to assign and the list will show me the name of the team members that are available and the issue can be assigned to them all right second thing is i can go ahead and add the label okay i can update the time tracking from here i can update the priority just by clicking and selecting a different priority in here i can also go ahead and update the so here it has gone to the parent but i can go ahead and let me go back so it has been pinned to the top so i can choose a different parent for this particular issue so you can change the parent as well similarly any of the fields that you see here priority more fields or any you know estimates and all anything that is editable for that particular issue and this editable and non editable is also configurable and there might be possibility that some fields are not you do not have access to edit some of the fields right but the the ones that you have access to edit and choose a different value that's how you can go ahead and see and edit the value and save the value as soon as you will update something so for example i ch choose a label here ios and i click somewhere else that particular value automatically gets saved within jira okay so this is basically how you are going to update the issue details in jira it doesn't matter it is an epic subtask task 
story, doesn't matter any other issue type that you might be working with if you are working in other domains, for example, HR, marketing, etc. Okay, so that's pretty basic and easy way to go ahead and update any of the details in the issues within Jira. I hope it was helpful. See you in the next one. Thank you.